Now here we are on the outside of the Stratus, and as you can see, this is in the indigo blue, which is a nice deep blue. It looks really nice when you get it outside, and we've got a high gloss 4000 Lamalux side. On the front, it's going to be nice and aerodynamic. Again, this weighs about 6,400 pounds. It's going to be nice, light, easy to tow. We have a power tongue jack, two 20-pound tanks with easy access to turn these on and off for your propane, and they're easily exchangeable on a weekend or a Sunday when uh, typically LP places are, are closed. Behind that, we have a battery disconnect so your battery doesn't drain down while it's in storage. You can just turn that off at the flip of the switch there. Coming over to the side, we are pre-wired for any solar panel that you would want to add to it. We've got super large and thick baggage doors. They're nice and wide to give you access to all of this pass-through storage. There's a motion light in there as well, so when you open that up at night, it will just turn on automatically. You're not having to hunt around for any of the switches. And then these just slam shut. We also use a key to light system. So there's one key for your main door and for all your baggage doors. It's unique to this unit and to you. It's not one of the common uh, RV 751 keys, if you're familiar with those. Coming down the side of the camper, as you can see, we've extended the awning out. It's a power awning. It's a Carefree Colorado. has a thicker gauge in the hardware. Comes up really tall on the side of the camper here so you can extend your patio space and walk right under it. You'll also see that there's an LED light on the roller tube of the awning and it shines back at the camper. Most campers are going to have the LED light on the side of the trailer and typically at night you know the bugs and things will kind of attract around that. When you open the door they all filter into the camper. So it's really nice to have it on that roller tube. Coming down here, you'll see that we have the solid steps. These are super nice for pets, kids, anybody of any age. They store right up inside the doorway. When you shut the door, it gives you a nice clean look. No steps to catch any of the road grime or anything like that. When the door opens up, the steps are nice and clean and dry and pull right out. They're all adjustable real easy to do. Another feature on our doors here too is we use the slingshot. So anybody who walks out of the camper, forgets to shut the door, it will shut on its own. Now we have an outside kitchen on this model which is going to give us a 110 refrigerator for all your beverages to keep cool and easily accessible from the campsite. We also have a two burner cooktop here which hooks right into your propane. For cooking outside and then you have hot and cold water in this sink here as well. Uh, this pull out drawer is a nice metal weather resistant not like some of the wood ones uh, will definitely stand the test of time. That stows away and shuts right closed. Coming around to the back side of the camper, you'll see we have this option with the cargo tray. The cargo tray supports 200 pounds. We have it shown here with the optional kayak rack, and your kayaks would mount straight up here in the air, or you can use it as a bike rack. We have a ladder here as well, which can get you onto the fully walkable roof. If something gets up there or you want to go up there for maintenance, again, easily done. All LED lights as well on the outside. 